Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is Cordam and we are back for some more Rogue Trader. <clears throat> we are in the Machine Cathedral. I think we are in the prayer halls or something, like an inner area. Uh, we just dealt with some Chaos Marines here, plus a word better Assailant, which got kind of messy because of an interaction with Idira, <laughs> but we got through it. And now we're gonna explore... Oh, cutting already. We're gonna explore the rest of this area. Some warp manifestations here? Oh God. Is this gonna be like one of those puzzle areas where you have to... Where you have to cross the room... Color the uncolored. And not step on these? I'm actually gonna quick save because, I'm gonna be honest, if I take damage from this, or injuries, or traumas... I don't know if I want to deal with it that. My destiny <clears throat> to traverse Might just quick load, honestly. Of frightening creatures. I cannot discern their true yeah, so in the there we go. This is ample right here. I'm just trying to move, and she turns and walks through it and gets trauma. I... <sighs> Man, at least if it only gave me, like, a, an injury, or, um, or I took some damage, that would be fine. I... 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 Honestly, I don't understand who designed Does something trouble you, these Lord kinds Captain? of um, areas, you are especially on a CRPG. Like, who Sellia? thinks that this is a fun Ever since gameplay the mechanic? Paid a visit to Kalkazar, the I've warnings and machine right sets. Uneasy feeling. I'm just moving with Cassie because if I move with my entire party, people are gonna get stuck in this. Look. Euphrates 2 oh was besieged God, by the dude, forces really? of the I'm... enemy. <clears throat> I'm gonna load again, but I'm already losing my patience for this area. I was very excited to start this episode. There's so much that I think can be very fun to do in I these died. in these you next few areas, and then I'm, I get stuck with this. <sighs> I'm offering it. Lord Impedium, we pass. We failed. Okay. I'll guide. Yes, the game is already getting on my nerves. Many battles and okay. There's a door over here. <coughs> that could be progress. What else do we have? I've never wandered so much. No before. traps. Oh. Just cargo. A computational culture. I need logic for this, so I need ugh, I need Pascal. <clears throat> okay. It is my Duh. destiny to traverse the unknown. <laughs> no, these ruby flashes are. This is locked. Me. I'm just gonna explore. I'm gonna I'll see what's what, and I'm gonna load the game back and just go wherever I need to go. Okay, I've actually been here before. Yes, this is where we came in actually. Yeah, we came in from here. The world is full of colors I have never seen. I have before. to go there with uh, with Pascal. This door is straight up locked. Emperor, deliver us. Uh, any secret stuff over here? How no. Dare you? Can I? How can, can one I, find the right way without? I think his if I light. do like all my team and I click this, yeah, Pascal comes in, <laughs> which means it's gonna be a hassle as well. <clears throat> Reading damage to both. Do you yeah, yeah, yeah. An audience? This we'll read that soon. So shall it be. It seems like the only things of interest here are that chest, that check, and the quadrotator. And can we pass through here? We can pass through here. Okay. <clears throat> so we have a plan. I'm basically going to quick save on every intersection. Where I get some progress done. And I'm just going to lead everybody one by one to that door. And that will be it. Not not like that. Oh, thank God. Stop. Oh, man. Can you imagine passing Ulfar through this? The guy takes up four... Oh, okay. Thankfully, we can just move forward with this. No! Who will replace? Oh my God! 
Oh. I I just want to play the game. I just want to play the game. You are in the presence Jesus. of Jesus. You know what I'm going to do? You know what I'm going to do? <clears throat> I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I think I have a plan for this. I think I have a plan for this. How are you doing? Because screw this and screw whoever got this idea. I, am always uh, I think we passed it now. The statue is vandalized and mutilated, but even in this form, a figure in the robe is recognizable as one of the revered tech priests of the Adeptus Mechanicus. We have these goods over here. Sure, we've seen them. Do not step on the goddamn cloud. Okay, Cassia, just go over there. <clears throat> Quick save. That's step one. Now, step two is, what options do I have over here? I know I can teleport people to my main character. Yeah, teleport party to you. Can I... Is there a remove... That's door? That's not... That's not it. Okay. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to send <coughs> Pascal over there. I'm going to deal with the cogitator, Executing request. which I think is through here. That was close. Is like whoever thought this was going to be a fun idea. I swear to Christ, man. Don't... Okay, the manufacturer has been completely converted from rock and metal processing to a much more sinister purpose. The lines have been set up to manufacture shells for demon engines. Okay, that check is done. We learned that. <clears throat> I'm going to take my main character. I'm going to quick save. Because everything in this area is done. And my plan is I'm going to take my main character only. To that area there, so I don't have to do this once for everybody. Step. And now let's pray that this works. Teleport party to you. Oh, thank God, man. Thank God, quick save, man. Th this area right here, I, it's it's my least favorite area of the entire game. I'll Straight up, the there's stars. not even a competition. What do we have here? Hopefully no more of that. Oh, we have the, the, the Space Wolves here. <clears throat> Are they fighting? We've a killed the demon thingy me. already. Oh, no we didn't. This is something different. Whoa. Oh, no. I like his weapon, though. Uh, I can't see... Doom Scream. What the hell even is... He's killed two Space Marines already. The Vox speakers on the ancient monster's armor emit a blood-curdling screech that turns into the unholy murmurs of countless voices. Collect the blood of the false believers in a cup. Reap their... Uh, reap of their pitiful street. Uh, strivings, drink of their sorrow, and the laughter of the true gods will thunder in your ears. Halbrandt looks up from the bodies of his fallen brothers. You can hear the seething rage in his voice, distorted by his helmet's vox speaker. I am the wrath of the Allfather, and his wrath is to be dreaded. Traitor of the... 17th? I will have your head. Stand aside, young wolf. The baleful howl are here. This prey is ours. Look at the hell, brute. The Abomination's armor wetly gleams with profane repair scripts daubed in blood. It has been patched with fresh ceramite in several places, evidence of serious damage received in recent battles on the surface, but the monster appears to have fully regained its strength. Its flesh smel swells hideously as it is flooded with the power of the warp. Wolves, you are bickering when you should be fighting. This is important. I will do battle for my pack's honor. Brother Halbrand will fall back if he does not wish to anger me. 
booming drum sound from the Vox mounted on Halbrand's armor. In dark, uh, in our dark, he bars the doors. He who fears guests unbidden. He who fosters purpose and uh, purpose tainted. He who dreads his reckoning. Well, he knows that in our dark and savage, the grey beasts come to this door prowling. For blood they come, for vengeance they come, the guilty are their prey. Be you malefic, be you monster, know that a new burst of furious howling from the hell brute makes all far falter. I'm not actually sure what, what the correct uh, option is, but I'm gonna go and cry out proudly. The warriors of Rust will never retreat. With a lusty bark of laughter, Ulfar picks up your words and continues fervently. The warband of Fenris will never retreat. The scent will be caught and blood will be spilt. Like two virtuosic musicians, Halbrand and Ulfar fall into perfect rhythm of words, breath and movement. With a fierce howl, they rush to the attack, moving as if they are not two warriors but one. We're gonna mess you up, bitch. Where are you going? Okay, Doom Scream, 3700 HP. Blood Smith, uh, Smith Space Marines. Okay, I'm guessing that these are gonna be the dangerous things here. For this, we're gonna have to call Harem. <laughs> and let's see what this guy does. 40 deflection, no joke. Ruinous Blessing. The Hell Brute gains 100% armor and 40 deflection. Only Ulfar's attacks can significantly reduce the Hell Brute's defense. Okay, <laughs> that's kind of interesting. Mark of Corruption. A powerful melee attack that inflicts burning and mark of corruption on the target for one round. If by the time the mark of corruption effect ends and the target still has the burning effect on it, the, the target will suffer from 30 to 45 mental damage. Let the galaxy burn. The Hellbrute boosts its damage with infernal energy for two rounds. Its melee attacks will fire damage and inflict burning. Combat Master, of course. Runus Blessing. We've seen it. <coughs> All for a sec, can negate these effects. I wanna, I'm wanna. i curious how this works. Like, <clears throat> if Ulfar hits him once, he loses this buff? Or does, it, does he only lose the buff against Ulfar? I don't know. Critical Vulnerability. Ulfar deals 100% more damage to the Hellbrute and lessens the effect of Ruinous Blessing, reducing the Hellbrute's armor down to 50% and deflection... Oh, so he's a free kill. Eternal Hatred. When reaching 5% wounds, this creature restores 50% wounds and starts to deal more damage. That's fine. Death Blast. Yeah, that's fine. <coughs> so he's an easy target. The Bloodsmiths. Epicenter of Slaughter. It's fine. Desolation. Fine. Blood Sacrifice. This creature restores wounds equal to damage dealt by... Oh, fine. Fine, 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 fine. Not fine. Okay. It's fine. Um, so, Idira is gonna sit out of this fight. <clears throat> if I actually want to use Idira, she's gonna have to play <laughs> only after killing these. So, what I'm thinking is... Okay, so what I'm thinking is... I'm gonna have Cassia like over here. Doesn't matter too much. I need to have Ulfar in a position where he can do something quickly. So here. Argenta will shoot from over here so it, she doesn't hit Ulfar. And she's behind heavy cover as well. Uh, Idira, again, doesn't really matter because she's not gonna play right now. Cassia will give Ulfar the first turn. I will give Argenta the second turn. And Pascal, he will just chill, basically. Okay, so we have a plan. One, two, three, four, five, six. Right. So I'm gonna try and bring this down, uh, bring this guy down first because he seems to be an easy kill. Uh, and for that, I'm going to do this. Me, if you insist, Lord Captain. <clears throat> and take a turn. And what I do here is what? Man, the movement is so iffy. I could. 
rapid fire and shoot him. Or I can just go for melee. Oh, not that one. I don't know how much it how much damage it deals though. But I think I'll just stick with melee, right? What does my sword do again? Ah, nothing special. Okay, so let's go over here. And now we're gonna hit the guy once. Okay, let's see. Yeah, he's he's dead. Argento will kill him in one round. <clears throat> Say goodnight, bitch. Wait, this costs 3 AP? Ah, because it has the... Okay, I know why. Why are you burning? What? Why are you burning? Did I read something wrong here? Oh, stack 1 of 5? That is actually interesting. I don't know what this does, though. It's melee attacks deal fire damage inflict burning, but it didn't attack me. Ah, melee attackers must pass the willpower to test or start burning for two rounds. Okay, okay, I got it. It's fine then. Okay, so I'm gonna go for... <clears throat> I'm gonna go for rapid fire plus wildfire. So, or, or same thing. Wildfire, rapid fire, and now shoot this guy. Let me see here. Still says one out of five. He's bleeding. Yeah, he's he's completely dead right now. I can kick him, but is there a point to it? Well, I get fertility stacks. So, sure. Oh, kick. <clears throat> and we... Are going to make you a little bit more defensive with cautious approach. So and pass. And Cassie can just... Maybe go behind cover, like for example here. Even though it doesn't matter. And now, I am going to give Argenta voice of command Already done. and a turn. Suits my purposes. And hopefully she can just kill this guy right now. So, yeah, zero deflection. We're going to do a lot of damage here. Uh, what I'm thinking is I have three stacks. I can maybe like shoot once and then rapid fire, wildfire and burst. That might be my my most damage here. Okay, so shoot him once. <laughs> Perfect. So now we wildfire, we rapid fire and we shoot 18 bullets at this guy. And let's see what happens. Okay, well, he's not dead. I'll do it. But he's soon to be dead, so I'm not gonna worry too much about this. Pass, pass, Cassia plays. And what Cassia is gonna do is. He will actually get a turn, which is kind of annoying to me. I could get... Wait. Yeah, you guys do have this. Okay, okay, okay. So what am I going for? <clears throat> I want the front line over here. Isn't this a That's for the sure. Serves? I want the rear over here. Can't actually see it. Damn it. Ah, I can. I am a navigator, and I'm going to go for servitor. the back line over here. Isn't this a Perfect. job for the serfs? This is overwhelming stratagem, which means all attacks by allies that are inflicting overwhelmed effect on any enemy that fails willpower resistance test for one round. Uh, I'll place it there. If I may. And now what do I do? I'm gonna reveal the light. Me. If you insist, Lord Captain. And I am going to give you air of authority.
six. So that's gonna be two on this guy. Make him take more damage. Although it doesn't really matter, does it? But oh, everybody has combat master. It's very annoying. <coughs> so yeah, take this. I'm not accustomed to being ordered around. Eh. If I could, if I could give the turn to Edita, we would have had heroic acts already, with it. and we would have already finished this fight. Sadly, not the case. Uh, <clears throat> can I hit? I can't hit them both. Maybe if I pull them. Really, I cannot see that area. Why? This is dumb. Okay. So what is my other plan? I could give Pascal a turn. What is he gonna do? Nothing, right? He's gonna shoot him and then what? Then nothing. I am just thinking. Um, okay. Let's have him get more damage. Me. If you insist, Lord Captain. And let's just hit this guy. Do I want to try and bring him over here with point of curiosity or this? Isn't this a job for the surf? That works. This way I can hit both of them. Okay. <clears throat> Not perfect, but... Now, are you going to kill my friends? What are you doing, dude? Ah, you suck so much. Okay. Really? That's... Yeah, that, is that all you've got? That's gonna be my question as well. He's gonna go down. Yeah, this guy will kill him. It's fine. He got back up because of the marine thingy. No, bitch! God damn it! I will rise. Oh yeah! No! Okay, bitch. Okay. This is how you're gonna play it. Okay, it's fine. 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 Not fine. <laughs> kind of annoying, actually. Smack you. That was most of my damage right there. Let's rapid fire. And burst him. Alright, perfect. And this is a lot more damage than my other options, so I'm gonna do it again. I forgot that reloading did that. Uh, wildfire. Burst. Okay. Kick. A lot of damage. Pass. Idira. What am I gonna do with you, Idira? Tell me. What am I gonna do with you? On it. Well, I'm gonna have to do something, right? Kogami. I cannot kill him. Pascal can probably finish him off. But I really don't want to push my luck. So I will just trail some people but here. Of course. We'll do. And I'm just gonna pass. Now Pascal can probably do something. Uh, I'm gonna buff my friends. Running by Derek override. And I can go for a perfect spot. And now I would like to shoot that guy for extra damage. Yeah. 
He's at 214. He's a machine, so he should take damage from this as well. Right? Maybe not. And I can go for claim the bounty, which is not really going to do much. Uh, I forgot to call the bull, that's right. Okay, can do it now. And shoot him. Okay, we killed him, but he got back up, apparently? Or what's happening here? What is happening here? He... Seems to be disabled, is that it? That might be the case. <clears throat> I'm gonna trail this guy. Okay. So what am I doing here? <clears throat> My main guy is gonna have to be Ulfar. Although he can't even reach them. <laughs> he can't even reach them. <clears throat> it's so annoying. Ah, this is so annoying. Still. All too easy. Take this. Can I do this? Not my no. specialty. Um, what I can do is <sighs> I can give Cassitrans in the potential. Have her use an heroic act on Ulfar. And then he's gonna try and do something. But again, he can't even reach the area. I'll still try it though. I'll paint your death in colors. Oh, I can. I, okay, I can go over here. Okay, so if I can go over here. This means. I can rapid fire. Shoot these idiots. Good. Kick this guy against that guy. Right. He's dead. We get Saber the kill, but I'm just gonna pass. And I'm gonna move. Get over here. Hit the guy. I challenge you, Falcon. And I'm gonna hit the guy. And I'm gonna hit the guy. My strike is ruined. Now I wildfire. And I hit the guy. Dies. She gets another save for the kill. Uh, I am just gonna pass. And now Ulfar is going to run over here. <clears throat> He's gonna run over here. And dash like over there. And I'm gonna pass because I want the Eroe Cac coming from my, my main character there. Okay, Pascal. Hot on trail, that's right. So we shoot the bitch. Request approved. Miss. We do joint analysis and we pass. Cassia is done. So now I can get the Roy Cat going on Ulfar. I'll bring glory to my bloodline. And he can finish him off. Okay, so let's go over here. Smack. Is on the heart. My instincts tell me to refuse. Smack. And smack. The wounded monster lets out a scream that resonates with the might of the ruinous powers and retreats. Its armor is riddled with holes and its vox speakers are clogged with tangled prayers of despair and joy. I fear not the blasphemy of the deluded, for it is promised to me. With my eye of flame I pierce the hearts of the doubting, for it is granted to me. I root out false faith, for I stand on a true path, and I will not be forsaken by the protection of the true gods. Ulfar is drenched in the Hellbrute's blood, which carries the acrid tang of machine oil. He wipes the blood from his face and bursts into deafening laughter. The ground itself seems to quake at his mighty display of joy. 
Behold, all father, how fleeting is a coward's valor. Instead of brazen hymns, please for salvation come. But my hands are full with weapons laden, without a finger's pen for mercy or for grace. But stay the old wolf's charge against the foe. Corruption's mighty beast he did valiantly ravage. But the right to sever its rotten word head will cl another claim a hunter fresh and battle bold. <laughs> Will Old Wolf give Young Le a lesson in battle? I think they're trying to what? <clears throat> Decide who's gonna kill them? If you do not stop this foolishness, more of our number will die. Ulfar's <laughs> voice becomes low and heavy with dire warning. Stand aside, young brother, our foe is wounded, but well banked is his malice and still smoldering. My lot will be as blow to meat, my hide here carries scars aplenty. To my elder bowing, the right of first blow yielding, but last for my self-keeping, the foe shall die by Halbrand's hand. Dude... Wait, what? What's happening? We're playing again? Why? Okay. But we've done this already. <laughs> Uh, Cassie can go over there. Okay, I'll do the same thing. So Cassie can go over there. Uh, I can place Ulfar over there because he's gonna shoot somebody first to remove the, the debuff. Or the buff, sorry, I should say. And then Argent is gonna finish him off over here because I'm gonna stay close to her over here. And the, ah, but now we can play with Idira. Now we can play with Idira. Okay, so Idira comes over here. So she doesn't blow anybody up. And Pascal can just go over there. But what? Is this like a competition to see who sees who uh, to see who kills them? I'm actually curious. Okay, so <clears throat> start the battle. Resolve to Edita. Emperor, give me strength. I'll actually do this differently, right? I'm gonna try and get it away cacked with Edita and then just have Ulfar kill him. <clears throat> All right. So resolve. Anything else? Buff. What? Was that you? Buff. Buff. Anything is. Buff. Heal and buff. Ray. Oh. And yeah, we're gonna get an ray kind. So we pass here. Uh, we pass here. <clears throat> and now I get over here. And what I do is I give him head of authority. Which should give us an heroic act. Nothing I can't do. Yep, perfect. Now I'll just do this. Right? Or I can just buff him up. I'll just do this, yeah. I so take that. Incarnate. And we go for the usual, which is we swap our weapons. Rapid so fire. Shall it be. Shoot six times. <laughs> Okay. <clears throat> now we swap our weapons back. We move in. Uh, or do I actually want to charge him? Do I want to charge him? Nah. <clears throat> Just move in. Hit. Our foes the okay. Uh, let's go for a wildfire and cleave to get some stacks. And we hit. And we hit. And we kick. And still hit. Done. The heretic, lowering his gruesome weapon is exhaustion in exhaustion, but still standing, casts a desperate glance at Ulfar. The Vox speaker crackles. In the abode of the true gods there is neither time nor prohibition. What is reflected there will endure forever. I was, and therefore I am eternal. Doom scream will resound in your ears. With glorious song the net buzz will drown out, and with sweetest miaud your traitor name will wash away. Tell the blood moon wolf you fell at noble Halbrand's hand. Hyolda! Halbrand, Halbrand shoots a defiant look at Ulfar who has blocked his part of the defeated monster. The young wolf raises his weapon ready to defend his claim to the prey. Will you people stop this, please? Whoa. <laughs> Many lessons have to you, young wolf, been handed down, so let this be your last. Tread not upon your elder's prey. 
ferociously declaiming uh, the last line, Ulfar knocks Halbrand to the ground with a crushing blow to the head, sending him into a deep stupor. Of the baleful pack, worthy was the hunt, their name will thunder at the feast of victory. Doom scream I ripped out, leaving it to cry, a tongueless silent wail. Wolf's howl has flown, above all arches soaring. Ulfar falls out and gives you a pensive look. The warriors of Fenris that proud litter extolling. In memory over graves of brothers worthy, eternal as our hunt in darkness unrelenting. I like this one. Eternal as our hunt in darkness unrelenting. Ulfar echoes your last words with the spiteful stubborn grin of a doomed man. Indeed, an eternal hunt is all that awaits me. Thank you, Cordant. Fine hunting, Advater. The prey and the verses have, have me well pleased. Look over Albrand. Judging by his sluggish movements, the young wolf is alive but not entirely lucid. A storm cloud of heavy bruising is spreading across his handsome face. What was that contest between you and Halbrand just now? He clashed the dispute over valor and inspiration. Battle fills a true warrior's heart with joy and his mind with piercing clarity. And we on Fenris hold in special honor to those who rise above the fray and share their joy with their comrades. Has your pack's honor been upheld? Ulfar walks over to the Hellbrute whose limbs are convulsing in vain attempts to raise his weapon. The wolf draws a knife covered in red runes and smiles at you. The name of the Baleful Howl was not tarnished in this battle. Wearing the same blissful smile, Ulfar casually grabs the visor of the heretic's helm and begins to wield the blade with the efficiency of a butcher. The dying enemy rasps and gurgles, choking on blood, as severed tendons snap and sawed bones crack under the fe fe Fenrisian steel. The Hellbrute's legs buckle, but he somehow remains upright, as if out of sheer arrogance. The heretic lives long enough to, ful to fully partake of the agony, and when Ulfar finishes, he is clutching the bloody horn that protrudes from the Chaos Worshipper's head. Ulfar swiftly carves a uh, protective rune into it and proudly proclaims, a glorious trophy. What shall we do with your brother? <coughs> <laughs> Noble Halbrand, it would be unwise for you to come with us, I think. It will be some time before you are well, and I do not want to have you to, an to answer to Allfather should you die. Let no one say a worthy warrior met his foolish end because of Ulfar. My heart is ready to fight, brother Ulfar, but my legs are in no hurry to carry me toward the enemy. I will join the fray when I can stand, if you would be so kind enough to leave a few heretics for my blade. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> so these morons... Competing, Has not at the best of times. Did I mention Man, these Chaos Marines are very annoying, Just I will say. Because of the stupid war thing. Cold. Okay, so how are you I'm fine, he's fine, she's messed up, she's fine, fine, fine. Now, do I have something that heals all... Yeah, effectively removes traumas. Does it remove all traumas? Need a little morale boost? Blessed be the hand of the Oh, it does. I'm very happy. Victory awaits. Perfect. We got an Astartes bolt pistol and a chain axe. I think these are worse than what we have. Poor Space Wolves, man. And Doom Scream had a bolt pi Oh no, this is from the other guy, right? Oh, this chainsaw grants 10% critical hit chance, all chainsaw... Uh, okay, that's good. And Hellbrute Horn Trophy. The wielder gains relentless range ability. This ability reduces the wielder's current armor and deflection by half until the end of combat. However, the wielder's critical damage is increased by two times the amount of the reduced armor percent, and their melee damage is increased by two times the reduced deflection percent until the end of combat. Can be used once per round. Now, nah, this sucks, right? I think it sucks. I do like the sword, however. Ah, uh, but it's... Okay. It's much less damage. And less armor pen. I'm gonna stick with mine. And this is the same. Okay. Logis Heretic. Arc Rifle. Space Marines. What is this? Looks different. Ooh, rate of fire 6? Gimme. Gimme it. Oh, it's it's better in every single aspect? Oh, yes it is. Oh, yes it is. Oh, it's a two-handed web. Okay. 
Uh, then, then wait. 25-35, Less armor pen. But I think I prefer the double rate of fire, though. So, give me my thingy. And my other sword. And we'll keep it like this. <clears throat> it's about time. Okay. Let me see how... How... Ah, come on. Really? Lord Imperium, 0%. Ah, I had, I, right, 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 right. I forgot about this. So this is a tiara. Much better. And 15 bonus instead of shadow field. Okay, we have to have a good chance here. Okay. Why? Haven't I studied hard enough? Damn you, woman. The anvil looks like an alien primitive element among the machines surrounding it. You suck. You suck. I'm very sad and displeased with this. None shall stand um, in my way. How difficult would this level up be? Very easy. An additional AP. <clears throat> okay, then this level up is perfect. And not gonna take me any time at all. More AP is always welcomed, my friends. Always welcomed. Always welcomed. Follow my lead. Okay, so we are through with this area. Uh, 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 uh. Is this new? It is new, okay. Thank Ross for my sharp senses. I can't see. Demolition, okay. Color the uncut. Dude, do you have 290? Oh no, it's bug. I'm still new yeah, to the okay. Again exploring. with the same crap. Yeah. I'll chart a course for you. Save Argenta. Let's see if you blow yourself up. Hopefully Sins not. hidden in the heart turn all to decay. Okay. <clears throat> I'm guessing she's gonna turn and blow herself up because of the way what the game does this. Us? Okay. I was able to actually manage that. The Emperor Good. favors me today. Never doubt awesome. me. The burden of failure is the I was almost so proud of you. Well, I still am. I still am. I still am. Ah, this was the locked door from before. Operation successful. Okay, I don't really want to go for Urlon right now. I think there's still more stuff to explore in this area. <clears throat> but let's see what we have here. A new challenge for me. My success is an irrefutable. Omni specs. Whenever the weather targets three or more enemies put an attack, those targets suffer minus int bonus times the amount of targeted enemies armored until the end of combat. Uh, what? No. Nay. I say I nay. Tolerate weakness. Hunt brothers, take heed. More traps. I better myself. myself. Oh my God! Would you? Who designed this level? I, I want to punch that person Does in the face. You, <laughs> I hate this so much. I mean, <clears throat> put traps in the game. I've Just don't make me so much do this stupid, whatever you want to call it, puzzle or whatever. It's so annoying. Okay, no more traps. When the so Argenta can come over here. Heresy grows. Go around. Onward. Duty prevails. Never doubt me. Okay, good. The massive cage is empty. It's bar. It's not empty. It's bars bear slashes made by massive claws. It's about time. It is most definitely not empty. 
Yeah, I feel like we're going towards Uralon. To Terebrum. Okay, I don't want to go there just yet. I'll lay claim to the stars. I want to explore the other area first. So we're going to go over here. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, just, just don't step on the stupid clouds. Okay. Victory awaits. But I kind of want to go to Uralon through this way. Seems like a cool way to approach him. At the same time, I want to explore the other area first. So the other way we had to go <clears throat> was this one here to the machine, to the main generator sanctum. I want to see what that's about. And this one is the same thing. Oh, did I miss this? Over. The air around the caged people is almost ringing with sorcerous energy. Before you are psychers, whose powers even at rest create service in the warp. Do you have your proper items, Idira? <laughs> of course he does not. <clears throat> of course he doesn't. S I forget the name of the other thing. <sighs> Why am I always blind to it? I don't get it. Is it just not showing up or something? Am I doing... Ah! Sliver. <clears throat> God damn it. Okay, there you go. Main generative centum. Where does this go? If it goes to Uralon, I'm gonna quick load. Because I wanna go through the other area. Oh, this seems like a... a, a... Let us see what I found. Seems like a different area altogether. Cast your eye there. Oh god. Okay, er stop. Everybody stop. Stop. S stop. I'm restless. Okay. So we're gonna have to swap I'm back to our warp stuff. Dynasty. That wasn't so difficult. Remove the warp barrier. The told me how. Okay. <clears throat> Remar. Sliver. Hood. Imagine not having this search bar. This exploratory okay. is blessed with multifunctionality. I'm still new to the art of exploring. My Lord. Why? Why? No. Over. The cogitator screen flickers as if the system is suffering a power failure. You reach out and touch the control panel, but quickly jerk your hand back. The device is coated in some sticky substance. Examine it. You know enough to determine exactly what happened to the machine. Glitchy projectors, otherworldly sounds from inside the case, an oppressive atmosphere in the room. Everything points toward the scrap code infection, one of the stranger and more frightening creations of the blah blah blah. Okay, we know this. Perhaps... yeah, okay, the same thing as before. Check for the decrypts. They are occupied. Two of them appear to be melted beyond repair, but you might extract the third without incurring data loss if you successfully deactivate the logical network of the machine itself. <clears throat> okay. You spent a lot of time trying to establish a connection between the countless switches and reels on the control panel and the twisted symbols floating on a glitchy screen. At last, you managed to complete the logical network, tame the rampaging system, and force it to disengage data crypts. So we got... At the same moment, the cortex releases a stick previously hidden beneath the protective panel and the device drops to the floor right in front of you. It looks like a logic key used to access additional cortex reserves. 
It may fit other systems in this part of the planet. So I shouldn't have broken the, um, the machines then. Right? Crap. See what the device is coated with. The corset of this case is covered with scratched symbols and signs thickly smeared in a pungent oily mass. You spot tiny bubbles emerging from the gleaming metal. It is almost as if the malodorous slime is seeping from these scratches like sweat oozes from pores on human skin. Examine the image on the screen. The eye-like sparks are yellowish origin color, but you are pretty sure this monitor counts as PlayStation Vivi Hue. You lean forward and the okay, this is the same, same time, the same thing as before. Examine the log. Not only do you fail to examine the log, even accessing it is quite an ordeal. Anything to protect on the blinking screen blurs and fades like images on melting film. I mean, I'm gonna break it just like I broke the other ones. Might as well. You smash the control panel with the first blow and the core set of screens with the second. No one will be able to this machine. Okay. So yeah, I'm guessing there was like a maybe a puzzle with this, but we messed it up. And maybe we can have a fight here. I hope it's not too long. Just quick save. It doesn't seem like a very long fight. Let's see. I won't heed your okay, so what do we have? Mercy. We have 16 enemies. But I don't see anything over here that's particularly nasty. So Cassia goes forward as usual. Ulfar will go over here. I think Ulfar will deal with these. And Cassia and Argenta will deal with those. So Argenta comes... Damn it. I'm gonna have to move her over there, but that's fine. Idira can maybe go over there. Pascal shouldn't matter too much. Go there. And I'm gonna stay close to Argenta. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Okay, so Idira. Me? If you insist, Lord Do Captain. not kill us all, please. Wait, can't go from there. Okay. So, resolve. But of course. Anything else? Pray. What? Was Pray. that you? Or... Pray. And... Let's go for the warp field on Argenta. But of course. Anything Buff else? you. Was Buff you. Was that you? Or... Give you temporary wounds. We're almost at uh, Heroic Act. And I can blind somebody. Is there like a particularly tough opponent here? Like this combat servitor? Yeah. We'll do. Okay, so he should be blinded, right? Yeah, because if... I oh my god. Okay, pass. <clears throat> oh right, I have one more AP. I gotta, I gotta get used to this. I need to get used to this, I forgot. <laughs> Give it him to him. Be careful not to cross my gaze. Pass. So now what I do is buff. Oh, it feels so good to have four of these. I will just give her my finest hour. My time is now. Okay. So now, how much damage can we do here? I'm guessing quite a bit. So we go here. We rapid fire. God Emperor, move we through. also go for Please devastating fire attack. In my heart. And do this and try to hit as many as possible. Or just try to kill this one. Uh, like. Yeah, like this. Uh, give me one second, please. And I'm back, sorry. <clears throat> uh, I think I kind of got distracted midway, but I feel like we only killed one guy. Uh, the other guys didn't actually get shot because of the curvature here or the slope. So I'm thinking maybe of going for these instead since they're kind of close by. Oh, volatile you say, wait. When suffering damage, creature like this starts exploding on its next, oh, next turn. So it's fine, it, it, he's not going to have a next turn anyway. Uh, <clears throat> I kind of wanted to kill these people. But I'm afraid I might not be able to actually target them properly because of the stairs. And Cassie is going to deal with them anyway, so 
I think I'll focus on these now. I can just get some stacks. Like, shoot somebody. For example, that guy. How much deflection do you have? 26? Holy crap. That is for the you, my emperor. Okay. Uh, don't, don't, don't hit him. Come on, man. Okay, so kill that one. As the emperor commands, I act. What? Was that? You're gonna make me dash over here. Faith without deeds is worthless. Okay. Wildfire. Oh, he does actually blow up. Okay. Uh, I think this is legit because I, I put... Pre yeah, this is legit. Anything is. And I think I'm just going to heal here. And... Damage somebody? Can I... Uh, if I move, can I do it? No. Okay, so let's not move. Stop moving. Just hit him. But of course. Alright, dead. Pascal's gonna buff us up. Pass. On it. And pass. And we're still doing something here. I'm gonna go for my heroic act. In thy light I Reload. And thy light Kill I him. So with this guy dead, we can actually just move forward, which is much better. So we go over here. I will bathe this battlefield in Revel in slaughter. Fury. And move a little bit As more, so we don't have to do with the I stairs. Am. And from here we shoot these two. Rejoice in battle! Why are you hitting the goddamn cover, man? I don't get it. I swear, I don't understand why she's doing that. Heroic act. I will just back off here. I mean. Not really, right? Because Cassie can give me the turn afterwards. So yeah, just stay there. So I can move. <clears throat> and... I guess I can give the turn to Olfar. So he can do something useful. Or to Idira. No, she's already had one. Uh, yeah, okay. Olfar. Go over there. The fame hungry comes. Get some movement going. And I'm thinking about maybe charge, hit and kick. Sure. What? Uh, what? What was that? I... Not what I was expecting, I will say. Hit the guy in the face and just kick him. Did he get knocked down? Oh, he did. Perfect. Um, and I will wildfire and hit him again. Okay. I'll just move over here and pass. And I go over Let's here see how they respond to and this. pass. And I get an heroic act again. <laughs> um, so she's already buffed. Yeah, she is. I will buff her further. Never wavered in the face. Make her my servant. Give her this Not again. Give her take aim. Already done. Give her inspire. All too easy. And just shoot someone. I suppose, or or I can just do this. Sorry, 
Uh, Cassia, take that. Nothing I can't do. Pass. <clears throat> so now Cassia plays. And Cassia will hopefully round up some of these idiots here. Yeah, I can see them all. Nice. Let's make them all... Actually, let's first start with this. Buff yourself. Battlefields are always drowned in scarlet. And now we round them up. Send them over there. If I may. Really, guys? Come on, man. Okay, what if I go... Oh, wait. Stop, stop. Um... Do you have Combat Master? No. Artificial. Immune to prone, fatigue, disturbed, perplexed, staggered, bleeding, and toxin. And horrors of the warp and mental damage. Cannot be pushed. Interesting. Not that it matters, but interesting. Uh, let's put the front line here. Isn't this a job for the serfs? Let's put the back, the, the rear here. I'm gonna back up. I don't want to be in the line of fire of Argenta. I can hit all three of those. So I will start by waking Nightmare. I'm not accustomed to being ordered around. And I think I'm gonna do a warp curse unleashed. And do this. Perfect. This was cover getting blown. So pass. And now double the bonuses. Um and just give you an turn. In the name of House Orcelio. In the I name of House prevail. Orcelio. I do realize I have to reload, but I'm just gonna shoot right now. Doubt is for the weak. That was actually fun. There's a Vox skull over there. Okay, reload. And Why the 57 chance? What if I do this instead? The enemies of the Emperor will okay. be undone. Um Okay, so go over here. And as the Emperor Revelin Slaughter. Commands, I act. I, I'm not even gonna use uh, rapid fire because we're already at 30 in the burst. Faith without deed eradicated. And they, <laughs> they die in one shot. Okay. In this case, she was way too accurate. She was way too accurate for my taste here. Yeah, this is just death. Okay. As the Emperor comes. Kill him. And I don't know why I can't use this. I should be able to use it. Um, over here, I think I'm going to... Just... Oh, no. Over penetration. That's not good. So I go here. And I shoot that guy. God Emperor, move through me. Be the fire in my heart. And now I can... I can dash... I'll do it. And shoot this guy. Well, basically he'll get sometimes. And I can rapid fire, uh, wildfire, commands, and shoot act. this guy. And I can ready up for the next turn by moving all the way over here. Okay. And I'm gonna ready up this and that. Is for the weak. And pass. <clears throat> and you can do this. I am a navigator, nope. not a servitor. All far. Yeah. Smack. Kill. So shall it be. This guy will take some time to kill because he has a lot of deflection, but still works. So I go for wildfire. I hunger for battle. I cleave. I 
Yeah, the damage is very, very low. Uh, let's go for Sense Priority. Why? I don't like that. Why can't I use my weapon? My instincts tell me to refuse. Doesn't make sense, but okay. None can this thunder. My strike is Kick the guy red. and let's get out of the way, actually. The so Argent can kill him. Hunt. Pass. Ah, maybe it will kill him. Never mind. So we go over here. And we are going to apply exploits. There is movement in the Empyrean. Buff. Anything else? And just kill him. What? Oh wait, are these guys the ones immune? Okay, because this is this is mental damage. That's right. This is warp damage though. Yeah. Can I reach you? I can reach her. In that case, um, I can't move any further. Damn it. I'll just go for this right now. See how much we roll. A good amount. And the fight's over. Okay. I will simply pick up the loot and we are going to finish up this episode, my friends. Uh, sniper rifle, what is this? Servo key to auxiliary generated chamber. Okay. Oh, that's over there. Uh, okay. Traps. Are there traps? No. Anybody injured by the explosions? You are injured? Did you want some? I okay, only him only our gentle. Huh? Right? None shall stand in my what? way. Let me just check out that Lord Imperium checkers box. Fine work gloves. Twenty-five demolition. Twenty-five tech use. Okay. That's cool for Argenta. And the Lord Imperium, I think I can just give the hat to her. You are in the presence of House Orcelio. Yep. I've read about this. The machine is functional but heavy al heavily altered. You see redundant parts and crudely welded modules. Stinking oil oozes from the cracks, and the dashboard is covered with symbols of chaos. There is no doubt that all these manipulations were intended to change the purpose of the device. Okay. Uh, so I think right now... I'm gonna finish this up. Uh, I think you still had the wrong items. Yeah, of course you did. Why am I not surprised? Remore. Sliver. And Hood. So with this, weakness. we have explored a bit of this area. Are we actually done with this? Okay. Hmm. Okay, yeah, I'll, I'll leave this for the next episode. I kind of want to keep going, but <laughs> it's going to be too long. Uh, we're going to explore this section here. And it seems like it's kind of it. Then we have to go back, explore the other section we still haven't gone to, and then we're going to go for Uralon the Cruel. Um, as always, my friends, I want to thank you all for being here with me in the channel, watching some Rogue Trader. I hope you guys are enjoying it. Questions, suggestions, anything at all, leave a comment below. If you are enjoying the content, consider subscribing for more. Many more videos coming out soon, and I hope to see you all in the next episode. Until then, stay safe, everyone.